Hey guys, Spectrum Minecraft here, and I'm back for another super hostile adventure map on Minecraft Xbox 360. And you know what? I've realized that what I need to do is get a set amount of uh, torches, because then this series is going to take a long time if I'm having a lot of torches runs. So at the start, I'm going to go back to the last area that I actually conquered and pick up all the coal that I missed, because I'm pretty sure I missed a lot of coal. And someone told me that Vex usually hides chests, like, under this, uh, starting thing here. So I'm going to check that out really quick, but I don't think there is one, because this map isn't actually made by Vex. It's just sort of like, oh, whoops. It's just sort of, um, a map that, uh, I don't see anything, but... I guess I didn't look very hard. There could be one in the roof or something like that. Um, but yeah, I'm going to go I'll look for all the coal that I would have missed. See if there's any up here. I don't think there is, so... Try to get some... Um, Alright guys, though there is some stuff that I do want to go over with. I, a lot of people weren't very happy with the fact that I was ending server survival. So I've actually decided that, you know what, um, I will keep doing server survival. But so that all these series actually go uh, fluently, or like all these, so that all these series actually happen. Um, I, I'm gonna want to light this up just because I don't like mobs very much. Um, I'm always sort of a perfectionist. I'm probably never gonna come back here, but I want to light litten up just because. So yeah, um, I'm not going to stop server survival but I'm not gonna I'm gonna upload it at the exact same day as other uh, let's plays so I think I'll upload server survival and my adventure map here um, super hostile on the same day so I'll have two uploads every couple of days when I upload super hostile and um, server survival because I think these will be my rival series some people are happy with uh, super hostile but I think a lot of people um, weren't exactly happy with ending Server Survival. I had some dislikes when I said that I was ending it, so you know what, that's fine. I will keep, um, doing Server Survival. I will not cancel that. And what I meant, though, when I was canceling it, I wasn't actually canceling playing with you guys. I was just canceling recording, so I would have still continued to play with you guys, even if I did stop recording episodes of the, uh, Server Survival. And I just want to figure out what this would have done. There must be, like, teen yeah, this thing here would have done absolutely nothing. Um, okay, that's sort of cool. So, mm, let's check out. Oh yeah, there's a lot of coal on this side. Coal is always good though, because we're going to need a lot of that to get past the maze rooms. And I don't know if the maze rooms counts as its own section, or it's just like a sort of crossroad thing that I have to get by. We'll have to be open. I want to explore every room just in case there's like wool or anything in one of them and I really don't want to miss anything because the maze room will get uh, pretty confusing if I don't um yeah, I'm just gonna want to ex explore every part of it just so that I don't miss anything important that I might need for the future so yeah I'm gonna want to uh, find the victory monument so I can set up a house there so I have some uh that's where I'd set my spawn point I think too um, and I still don't know where that is, so... Yeah, I think this should be enough coal. Let's see how many torches I can make. Nice. That's a lot of torches. So, I guess head upwards would be the general direction I want to be heading in. And I'll go back, get some food, um... Because I really don't have much food. Another sword, I'll get the iron. So maybe I'll just bring the stone one just in case I need the iron one for the future in case some places get pretty intense. So, um, yeah, let's run back. Do I have any... I could try to grow this tree up too. Oh, okay. Um, it didn't grow for me. But whatever, I do have lots of bone meal. I don't exactly need wood at the moment, but if I do end up needing any, of course I can go... I uh, grab that tree whenever I need to, so let's see, just let's get rid of that flesh. I don't need that filling up my inventory. And the melons. The fish, I guess, because I don't know how long I'm gonna be gone. Oh yeah, an extra sword. Um 
Cause I don't think this will last me. So let's bring the stones just in case they break pretty fast. And let's go explore this place. So I want to light up all the rooms. So that there's not a lot of mobs always spawning there. I like how he made the crossroad like slabs so the mobs can actually spawn on this. Um, cause that would get pretty brutal. I guess the, it's pretty bright. Oh. Um. Get away. Uh. Eh. Yeah, <laughs> that was crappy getting it through my inventory there. Um, so did he actually like spawn there? These rooms are so big and awkward to light up. They really burn through your torches. Um, get all the dark spots lit up, I suppose. Oh man, this guy does some damage here. Um, try to get some uh, hearts back here. These skeletons, they suck. And it's always skeletons that I'm fighting. There's some no no zombie. Um, okay, so let's light this all up here, and I I'm assuming the zombies above me. Um, for some reason I'm having goosebumps right now. Maybe it's just because my house is really cold. I hope so because I don't really like these rooms here. Oh, another creeper. Well, ain't that pleasant? Okay, if he explodes and takes the zombie with him, I'd actually be okay with that. Um, I don't think it's gonna happen. Though. Yeah, I'm way too good. Luckily that wall was there. Oh, I hear an Enderman. The Enderman's gonna be a real problem. And I'm gonna wanna get a source of food. Pretty badly here. Is this the same Enderman from last episode? I really hope not. Um. Okay, well... What? Oh, I didn't see him there. Damn. Okay. Uh, that wasn't that much of a problem, I guess. Um, as long as he does. Oh shit! Why are there so many of these? Okay, explode, please, explode, explode. There we go. The belt. Two birds with one stone there, and let's try to light this ground up here. Get all this. Why are there so many creepers now? Oh, shit. Yeah, I'm just going for the double tap on the creepers here just because I want, don't want to spend too much time fighting these guys. They're really annoying. And actually, I don't think there's anything on these bottom levels here. Um, if there is, I'm missing it, but it all goes up to the stairs is what it all leads to. Expl explode, please, sir. There we go. These creepers are actually <laughs> helpful. Um, as long as none creep up on me on last, like last time. That was a close call, but... Oh, okay. So this room's different, and that's a good sign. That's not a good sign. Oh yeah, he's stuck in the spider webs. Haha! That's what I don't want to happen to me, though. I want to get stuck in spider webs and just basically get hung dry there for the mobs to tear me apart. Um... Ooh, a chamon table. I got some levels. Oh, I didn't bring me, um... I didn't bring me, um... That was some bad... Bad stuff there. I'm gonna chant my pants, because I want some armor stuff. I'll just put a six. Protection one. That's good. And I could enchant my iron sword here, too. When I come back to this place. That will be my, uh... Goal, I guess. What is up there? Um, fences with stuff on top. This is a good sign because now there's different sort of terrain. How did I not see this when I filled up this room here? Okay, well, obviously there's no other paths that go this way, so I'm just gonna check out what's back. Oh, this must be the the somewhere else. So I'm gonna explode the um, top stairs after. The ground I gained with the creeper I don't want to lose again, so I'm just gonna... Oh. Actually, yeah, it might be a good time to leave. Um, try not to fall in lava, that would really suck. Okay, so... On to step two, I guess? Yeah, that enderman, I don't exactly want to fight with him. Oh, what's... 
Oh shit. Oh yeah, there's a lot of mobs spawning up there. It's gonna be some problems. Um Oh. Okay, explode by the spider, please. Or not. Okay, just fall down there. This Enderman will destroy me. Um, <laughs> that's the one guy I don't want to fight here. This is Mr. Enderman. We can be buddies, right? Alright, um. Let's try to get this place filled out. Okay, this is a good sign. Some sort of crossroad thing that's not exactly... Hmm, okay, you explode by you. Oh, you didn't kill the... And that reminds me, I haven't been eating my food. You know, I'll just eat this to speed it up. Um, maybe I should stop sprinting. That's probably a good idea. So I could literally just have creepers strip the walls of this place and there's bedrock below it. So I wouldn't have any problems with that. So that's probably the way the wool is, if there's a wool in here, because I think this just connects to a... Mm. Okay. So... Ooh, there's a chest. Um, nice, some boots and some cobblestone. I don't exactly know why I'd need cobblestone, but uh, I'm, I'm always down for better boots. I'm pretty sure gold is better than leather. Um... Yeah, that looks looking good, and now I just got this place left, I think, and then I have that one crossroad that I didn't go down last time. Okay, I'm out of torches. I'm seriously out of torches, so... Is it wood that I need to get? Or... Yeah, I've been in that room, so... I have the coal, I just don't have the wood. So I'm gonna have to take a run back. Um, that sucks, cause I don't exactly want it. Why are you down here? I hate you. Ugh. Okay. It's, wow, that sort of sucked. Um, okay, so I'm gonna go try to get some wood back at the uh, tree spot. Maybe it's grown up by now, or I'll have to um, get into my bone meal stash here that I have. Yeah, I think that's gonna be it. Uh, bring out the bone meal. I have nine. Yeah, there we go. So, um, yeah. Hey guys, Spectrum, I'm back. I'm sorry for that cut there, guys, but when I do cuts like that, that just means I'm doing cuts just to assure that the video file doesn't actually corrupt, because that really sucks when it does happen to me, but a lot of the time my voice recordings corrupt. So, you know, every 15 minutes or so I go and restart my recording, and that's why I used to do such short episodes, actually. And then, whenever I do these and want to have longer episodes, I just make sure to, um, like, cut the, like, I basically put two episodes together. That's what I'm technically doing right now. I just record and then wait a bit and then go record again. The mob spawns in this map are atrocious, um, because the outside of the map, I'm assuming no mobs are spawning. I'm... What I saw the video where I downloaded this from is this map is actually like a bunch of little boxes connected in the sky or something like that. It's pretty crazy whoever made this map put a ton of work into it. Um, and yeah, it's like an awesome map. So I'm really having a lot of fun with this, guys. Um, I'm going to be getting some coal here, so I'm just going to talk about some stuff. Um, I don't know, at school I'm doing this project in music classes. I had to pick a... Canadian artist or something like that to do music on and then I honestly don't know that many Canadian music people artists or anything like that so I was just looking through and then I found this dubstep group called Zed's Dead or whatever and then I was like oh yeah I've heard a couple of these guys songs before so maybe I'll uh, do these guys and then I didn't like their music at first but the more and more I started listening to it it was pretty good stuff so I don't know guys I don't think I've ever talked about much personal stuff like this or like anything like musical preferences but I like dubstep um I don't know what you guys I think a lot of people hate dubstep but that's just because they see what's on the outside if you find what's um some good underground dubstep it doesn't have to be I like chill step a lot stuff like that because it's just the uh, like it's actually good music people say that it's like I don't know just guys sitting there like 
making a bunch of crazy sounds on their computer but it's actually some pretty like intricate stuff you know the melodies and stuff they do some people uh, mix dubstep with classical music and uh, that's just the sort of stuff I listen to um, uh, I also like uh, classical music and rap and stuff like that um, oh okay well I got some mobs here so gonna start walking towards me yeah, let's go buddy let's go um yeah I like the type of music that pumps you up and stuff like that uh, most of the time more epic stuff uh maybe I still don't have enough torches for this entire room maybe there's some in this chest here oh hey buddy um okay I'll kill this guy off pretty quickly here and then try to towards the rest of this room here and then I think that's all I have enough for so there better be torches in this chest or else um okay well I'm not gonna say that I don't like this sword but some torches would have been nice too um maybe I could go on a darkness run and just book it through there but I think I'm gonna need a lot more torches so I'm going to go back to that little cave place I found sort of by the lava and try to make some torches there. I have to be careful about running because I'm really not doing the best on food here actually. I'm going to run out pretty soon. Um, and then I'm going to be lasting on like apples and other things that I can get from the trees. Because I don't have a renewable f food source here so that's... I think there's usually one at a victory monument, if I remember correctly from like what Etho did, if this map's anything like that. Maybe can me melons and, I don't know, seeds. Stuff like that when I get there. Um, hopefully I can find that sometime soon. How much is that worth? 16. You know what, I'm just gonna go with that, because I don't see any in this room here. Any more coal. Although I will have to go in there and do some more uh, looking around in there because obviously that's the only other place I go. I could do beware the stair, but I could do that. Um, but I think I want to go down that cave just because there's probably some torches down there. This map is so dark, obviously, because there's no like mob, uh, mob spawner boxes or anything like that where you... So you have to have darkness to make mobs actually spawn and make maps like this interesting. So, hey buddy, let's see how fast this kills you. It's still four hits, so it's really not that good. And it's a gold sword, so it's going to break soon. But I'm assuming it does like a bit of damage, not a full heart, but maybe 0.5 or something like that that can help me out in the future. That was some pretty reckless fighting there. Um... Obviously that wasn't the best way to go. I was hoping that maybe he'd take mobs. Yeah, here's a vic uh, some wool for my victory monument. Finally. Yeah, my gold sword's already almost broken. So much for sharpness one on that. Um, what? Are you serious there's a creeper in there? Okay. Okay, <laughs> sorry, I was uh, just doing, ooh, okay, black, um, nice, uh, okay, so I got the black wool, just took three just to make sure that nothing bad happens, I want to run back to my chest and put this there, or I could continue onward and not go back yet and hope that all I got left is, you know, I can eat some rotten flesh here, um, so when I get to the entrance of that place, I'm going to eat the rotten flesh until my hunger fills up and I'm just not going to move so that my hunger doesn't go down at all. I really don't need to go back actually because if, even if I die and lose anything, I don't need to just bring the wool back because obviously there's so much in that chest that I'm really not losing anything important. So let's stand here for like 30 seconds. Oh. Dang it. Hey, buddy. <laughs> um, 20, 20 seconds left. 19. Oh, yeah, I'm a Baka. Um, who do I gotta be? I like tree people. 
Um, I feel a penguin. Penguins are pretty sick. Yeah, I'm playing offline, so when I pause, it uh, actually stops the game. I like doing it that way so that there's not mobs running around when I pause the game, so I can cut recordings and stuff like that. Three, two, one. Okay, well, I'm st I'm missing a food bar, I guess, just because I hit the creeper, probably. And then it started knocking my uh, hunger down there. There's some more coal. Just make sure no creepers creep up on me, because they're always doing that. I actually love um, maps like this. I'm so glad that they made one that's this good for the Xbox. It's a lot of fun, guys. You should, guys, if you want, you could get it, or I might spoil the ending, or whatever, of the map. You guys might figure out where everything is, and it wouldn't be as fun if you're watching my uh, series here. But, um... Oh, man. I really took some damage there from that, uh... And the zombie. Okay, well, I need to get all the coal I can get. This is actually a big vein here, considering everything else I've been uh, I've been getting. That's a good coal vein there. Hopefully, nothing creeps up on me while I'm turning my back. Oh, okay. So it ends. Um, obviously, so. Oh, wait, I'm almost dead. I forgot. Oh man, I forgot that you're uh stop recharging <laughs> health when you're out of food. Whoops. Okay, I I'm gonna have to sprint there. I got the good shit this time though. They don't stand a chance against my bow. I guess that would have been a good idea to start uh, doing is using my bow. That thing's pretty effective, probably better than using a stone sword. Um, I will lose quite a few hunger bars though just from sprinting there. I don't want to start jumping because then my food bar is just going to start going down like crazy. But I really have to get my stuff back. I hope there aren't going to be a bunch of mobs there when I get back. Pretty sure I got time though. If I fail this run then I might have to worry about my stuff disappearing. But I got time. It's like five minutes or something like that and then... Like I'm really close already. Um, as l if I lost this stuff though, then I'd start having problems. Yeah, just like, you're done, buddy. Um, not a chance. There it goes, there's my stuff. Why did I have redstone? Probably because I was messing with that trap or whatever the heck that thing was, um, in the white, uh, room with the, uh, stuff in it. With <laughs> the wool with the stuff in it, um, let's see, actually, I don't need the sword, because I got my iron sword, yeah, so let's keep going, that was a little detour, if I was playing this map hardcore, where if I died, series over, the series would already be over right now, because I died in, like, the first episode, what is this place, whoa, oh, man, Got mobs on me here. Um, okay. This place is sorta of Oh. Oh I see. How did so many mobs spawn in just a small area though? So what is this? So there's an entrance behind the water there, but I might like drown. There's like a chest there though. This place is really cool, so I'm gonna see what's in this chest. Oh, they're gonna be underwater breathing helmets. Awesome. Now I can breathe underwater for longer, at least, I think. Um. There. Whoops, I threw a torch down. I'm gonna pick that torch back up, and then... Swim. Hopefully I make it. I haven't... I don't have a very good start here. If I need to, I'll just break a block in the roof and take a breath. Yeah, I definitely need the respiration. If I was trying this without it, I'd be dead. So I'll go right, so... I have to remember which way to go next time. Which it would be the left? Yeah, or just straight, I guess. Or maybe both actually end up going the same way. Hmm. Oh, I think I'm gonna run out of air here. Yeah, I gotta break the roof. Is it breaking? 
Oh no. Could be over here. I gotta break the roof. Oh, there, there are breathing spots in the roof, seriously? Wow, I got really scared for nothing there. Oh, wow. Um. Okay. Oh man, if I only had known that. Those were there. I wouldn't be having any problems whatsoever. I really like the water path here. This is cool. And the fact that all of these are source blocks or unless you just put like water at the top but so I don't know if I should actually go explore what was that way then and see if there was something else because might have been just been like two paths to accomplish the same thing there's there's a respiration spot I think there we go um but yeah I think there were just two paths to accomplish the exact same thing this is a big room and I don't know if I'll be able to like Oh, I see. So here's the, uh, the wool. Is this full of water too? Oh, there's no water in here. Okay, it's the blue wool. I see why. There's like squid in here and stuff. This is very cool. Um, okay, well, I'll go back the right way now this time. And see if I can get back without drowning. Hopefully not. Um... Go the right way just to see if there's anything cool. I guess I can't put any torches down on glass. Um, like, I could put a torch down, and you guys are probably like, it's underwater, of course you can't put a torch down. But for like a split second, it sort of lights up the place. Um, yeah, I'm so glad I have this respiration helmet. This makes it a lot easier than it would be, for sure. Take a breath. So whenever you see signs like that, it means take a breath. Um, maybe there's... Wait, is this like a dead end? Oh, it goes up. And there's some pretty strong downward current here. Oh, man. I thought it was just like a dead end. I'm like, that's sort of a waste of time because you swim so slowly. And it's just so hard to get out of here with all the downward current. There we go. Now I'm moving fast again. Is this side... Mo oh, I need, I'm gonna need to find a sign somewhere here. I don't see one. Oh no. There's gotta be one. Yes, that's that's my sign. Gotta get there. Yeah, okay. That wasn't too hard. Just did like I'm glad I noticed those signs because I would have died if I didn't. Um, keep swimming back. This is such a cool map and. I'm sad that I only record like an episode every couple days because I wish I could play this more. This is a lot of fun and I'm, there aren't really any new games out so I don't really know what to do all the time but that was fun. So um, yeah that's the water place. So what I got? I got the cyan, the black. This map's coming along pretty well. Got the penguin here. I'm just going to go back to Assassin's Creed. Um, I think I took the long way. Dang it. Ugh. Okay. There we go. So thanks guys for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed this. Next episode we'll see what's going into the cave. But I don't really know what's back there. So we'll see when we get there. This map's turning out to be pretty cool. And anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I'm um, just going to eat some raw flesh here. Just so that I can chill here and let my... Food bar go up. Thanks guys for watching. Spectrum out.